Hi, Tim Smith here again, and um, this time I figure we're going to do something that's very practical for all trombone players, and that is a quick little video on how to clean your slide. It's nothing short of disgusting, quite frankly. Uh, some of the slides that I see, especially in younger students, because um, you forget, you know, you, most of the time your trombone is in the case, uh, you play it in school, you maybe play a little bit at home, and then you just kind of forget, it slips your mind. Um, so let's work on this, especially with health such a concern right now. This is a really good thing to get in a, a habit of doing regularly. So the first thing you're going to do is take your trombone apart and set the bell section aside somewhere safe. Take your mouthpiece out and you're going to take both the, the outer slide off the inner slide here. Uh, and something that you can do, I, I don't have a bathtub in my studio, but something you can do is fill a shallow bathtub with lukewarm water and use dish soap, like Dawn or something like that. And you can wash your slide with dish soap. You just want to make sure that any of the soap that gets on it, you, you really rinse it thoroughly. So the first thing I'm going to do is work on my outer slide. Uh, so what you need for this is a trombone cleaning rod. Um, the, the one that I like the most is made by the Slido Mix company, and this is available at most music shops. Uh, and it's a piece of terry cloth that goes over top of, of a kind of semi-flexible rod here. And it is the whole length. It's actually a little bit longer than the slide. The great thing about this is you can get in there and really get all that gunk out. All that old slide, you know, grease that's uh, kind of caked in there and yesterday's breakfast and breakfast from two months ago or however long it's been since you've done this. And just give that a good swab and you're done. So now you can set down your outer slide somewhere where your little sister or little brother isn't going to come in and step on it. Put the cleaning rod to the side. Now you're going to get another rag, hopefully a clean rag and take your inner slide, so the one with the shiny silver tubes here, and you're just going to wipe that down. You don't want to pull on it too hard, but just wipe these off. Make sure you get all that residue, kind of all that white, uh, flaky, foggy residue off of there. Uh, you can use the cleaning rod on the inside of these slide tubes, just make sure that the rag isn't too tight, because if you get it stuck, it's a guaranteed trip to the repair shop, which is never cheap. Um, plus, then you're not able to use your trombone. Uh, so after I do that, the slide is now nice and dry. I'll go to my slide oil, which I really like the stuff in the white and purple bottle that Yamaha makes. This is trombone slide lubricant. Um, there's a bunch of different brands, but I found for my slides, this stuff works the best. Around the top, you're just going to dab maybe two drops there on each side. Set the bottle down, and then I pick up my outer slide. And what I like to do is I'll just do one tube at a time. I'll just kind of work it, work it in there. This works so much better when you take your slide off of your bell section. So it's very easy to mess up your bell section. I've done it where you smash your slide into the bell. Uh, so I like to do it. It's a lot easier to handle this way too. And then together, ah, that is lightning fast. It's clean. That's great. I'm excited to put this back together and see how well it works. Um, so I hope that's helpful. Again, you can, you can go the extra step of soaking it in the bathtub and really cleaning it out. Um, they even have an attachment, uh, it's not handy right now, that screws onto the bottom of this cleaning rod and it's a flexible brush to go around the bottom crook, the bottom, uh, the bottom part of your slide and get all the gunk out of there too. So I hope this helps. Thanks.